Hey everybody, my name is Kim Hawk and I'm known as the Fairy Godmother of Real Estate on the Near Disney YouTube channel. And today I am super excited because one of the favorite things that I like to do, and I know many of the viewers are saying this to me as well, that you want to meet cool people that live in the town that Disney built. Well, not only am I introducing you some cool people, they're some of my favorite people. And they are also, Neo Bellavati is gonna be getting the Pat Schroeder Award. Congratulations, Neo. Thank you. <laughs> Well, as many of you know, we ask for nominations from teachers or parents or friends. And Daniela is a very dear friend of mine, actually a um, very big part of Near Disney. And so I get to see why, in particular, you would nominate your son, Daniela. You want to talk a little bit about Neo? Yeah. Well, it's so hard to talk about <laughs> To talk about your kid to be partial like her, you know, I, I love everything about him. He's a very cool kid. He was very, he was born in New York City. And uh, one thing about Neo is like, uh, he was very social. He would like uh, go every elevator, every bus ride in New York City. He would say hi to everybody. Uh, he's, he would ask them like, um, what they were doing, like where they were going, like he was very social. He was he wanted to talk to everybody, and he wanted to be Spider Man too. <laughs> Doesn't everybody want to be Spider Man? Spider Man. <laughs> you know, Neo, I love your backdrop. It looks like you're in a cool New York hip, you know, studio now, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> pretty nice. Yeah. So what I can share as well is, you know, he's brilliant. You know, so mama, I think sometimes it's okay. Mom, you don't have to say it. I can say it for you. Thank you. Um, Neo <laughs> has come into my studio where I've spent like hours trying to figure something out. And he sits down at my desk and within two seconds, he's figured it out. <laughs> and I just walk away like, you know, he just gets it, you know? And so he, if the viewers have not seen, please go to the Near Disney YouTube uh, station, the channel, because you will see videos from the Bellavati brothers. Mm -hmm. Neo's got two other brothers. Neo, you want to talk a little bit about your family? Oh uh, yeah, I have. I have two siblings. I have Nolan and I have Nylan. Um, Nolan's my. He's not the youngest, but he's younger than me, so I'm the oldest. And 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 that takes <laughs> that takes I guess some responsibility. It's funny. <laughs> gotta t gotta keep them in place, and so. I'll start with, with, with me, obviously, because I was born in New York. And the fun part is that Nolan was also born in New York. And so, and then a little later, Nylon came into the picture and now it's a family of, of three boys. <laughs> I bet my mom loves it. <laughs> she is surrounded by men, you know, D is our marketing director too. And so he's genius as well. Your whole family is musical as well too. Daniela, I swear Neo reminds me of a young Paul McCartney from the Beatles, <laughs> which is a compliment, Neo, by the way. <laughs> but you do homeschool, which is cool, but that means you don't, that's, the girls are going to be like, where is this young man? Where is he? Well, you're soon going to be able to find him with Illuminate Church. I believe you're going to be starting with him September the 3rd, which is just around the corner, right? Absolutely. And I think that's a Sunday night at 5 p.m. in the Illuminate Church, the office space. But tell us what you're gonna be doing for the band. Well, I've been practicing for a bit now and they're actually looking for just band members in, in general. And so September 3rd will be the first time I play. I'm, I'm the pianist, the keyboardist. <laughs> Well, you come from a musical family, you know, your family has written songs with me as well and uh, with Bill Vanderbush. And I know we've done a lot of contemporary Christian type of music, but tell me a little bit about who are some of your favorite musicians that you like to listen to now? That's difficult because I have multiple. <laughs> I mean, I'll, I'll always list, I'll always have the Beatles in the back of my mind because it's the one thing my parents always play in the car and I will never forget it. My dad is just, Oh, let's let's put on a song, and there's the Beatles. <laughs> well, I can, I can sing constantly because of him. Every single lyric to every single song. Well, that is a great foundation to get all those chords right, and just knowing, you know, all all the Beatles were pretty smart too, right? Mm -hmm. You know, the way that they would, you know, have a song and not necessarily have it written down, and they could keep playing it all the time, and they were all in sync, and so. 
I can see you being in a band like that. But talk to me about where do you want to be in 10 years? Do you want to be in a band like the Beatles or do you want to be having a YouTube show or you want to do a whole bunch of what or something completely different? Mm -hmm. Well, I don't think I'll see myself in a band, but it's definitely something that Oh, it'd be nice. I can I can play. It'd be it'd be something I, I'd work on. I'd be proud of. But I think in terms of of similar in a similar sense, I'd just like prefer to write, be a writer, be able to write books, be able to even write the songs. That if I am in a band, I might just write the song for the band. <laughs> and in ten years, I don't know. It'd be I I could find myself working anywhere. I have a, a huge love for psychology, and so going into college, going into school, being able to learn that, into understanding how people think, how they how they talk, how people feel, what they like, what they don't. Everything in society is built off psychology, and so being able to take that, put it into a different perspective for people to enjoy, so social media basically, have a YouTube channel, let's make a podcast, let's have somebody listen to this, etc. I absolutely love it. I love writing. And if anything, I know that'll be incorporated in the next 10 years or so, whenever, whatever I'm doing, basically. I love that. That also sounds like a brand, somebody that's in charge of branding, you know, because you kind of have to know what people like, what they don't like. I completely get what you're saying. And I can see that. Daniela, what do you think? Do you see that in this future? Yeah, Neil is, he's actually an old man in the kid's body. <laughs> Yeah, he always thinks ahead. Like his name is Neo, that means new. And uh, yeah, so I'm sure like uh, he will create something new. And yeah, he's he's very deep in our conversations, but he's very practical. He, uh, he's you know like uh, psychology, is something that I always liked too. And I think it ripped off on him, <laughs> and uh, he gets it. So he's like, uh, he's besides D, he's my best friend. I always we have long talks, and I ask his him his advice. Um, yeah, we talk a lot. He's a he's a very good friend too, very good, and a very responsible brother. He's yes, oh, he's he's like his brother they look up to him and then you know like uh, instead of asking us like uh, they ask neil like uh, neil what is that what do you think of that like uh, they respect him like uh, he's a great brother and a great friend yeah i've seen i've witnessed that i've witnessed that too so neo that is a good example of um it, a couple of interesting things are popping to mind so pat schroeder who's a congresswoman from uh, colorado who was very well loved she passed away not too long ago and we're spending a year looking and identifying extraordinary youth you being one obviously now which by the way you know your father played at the celebration of pat's life so yeah, so this even makes more, yeah, it was beautiful. He played the guitar. It was very lovely. And so we're looking for youth that are making this world a better place. And how do you make this world a better place? Well, one example in particular is seeing youth where the younger brothers are looking up to you and that you are taking the time and not rushing them through an answer and you protecting them. And then, but I see you do that with other people too. And I see you being kind too. Let's talk about your furry friends you want to talk about oh absolutely aside from my brothers it's it's i got buddy and i got leo so it's it's you'd expect it to to only be with three boys but no we added two more to them we have a uh, we have a dog and a cat <laughs> all boys all boys i think your mom deserves at least like a little girl bunny rabbit or something oh my god <laughs> i know she wants the horse but well, we'll we'll see when that happens Oh, okay, okay, okay. So being kind to animals and then also, you know, putting out good content that's positive. And when when you look at, please go, like I said to the audience, please go to the YouTube um, channel, look for the Bellavati brothers. You will see, you can just see it in the video, how the other brothers look up to him, how he's a good leader with them. Mm -hmm. um, and you know, he can be behind the camera, he can produce things, he can write things. And we've noticed that a lot of the winners of this award are speaking multiple languages. So I feel like I'm way behind, Neil, because <laughs> you speak English beautifully and Portuguese beautifully, and you probably can speak 10 other languages. But, you know, it's 
really impressive, Daniela, this group of young people that are coming up mm -hmm. and gives us a lot of hope, you know? Yes. So, yes. Yeah. I'm amazed. Yeah. I, I, I'm surprised every day, like when they grow up, see their personalities, their friends. I was like, oh, what did we do when they, we were that age? <laughs> yes. Oh, dear. like Slacker, you know, he's already playing the piano. He's already able to yes. set up a computer. You can do whatever, you know. So and nice. Like all the software come installed already. <laughs> yeah. We have to learn all of that. They, they had it now already. <laughs> I love it. I love it. So there's going to be a couple th cool things that happen, Neo. We are partners with the Downtown Diner in Celebration. And so Adrian Perez and Courtney Perez want to give a shout out to the diner. We love them. We love the diner. Love the diner. And so with them being partners, they, um, Pat Schroeder was a big fan of ice cream. And so we created a Pat Schroeder milkshake that you you can have and your mom can have but you can also go down there and pick whatever milkshake the two of you prefer because it's the person that nominated you and you and also we are partners with the celebration foundation and they are going to ask me for your address and they are going to put a sign in right in front of where you live saying that an award winner of making this this world a better place lives here you know your your mom and dad have done a great job and so um, we, we have you and now we're going to be looking for in a couple more years, another brother, and then a couple more years, another brother. And so we're going to be in a good spot. Mom, you want to say anything else? I just want to say that we love you, Kim, that you, uh, you like, you should be getting an award because you are amazing. You're such a generous person and we look up to you and you are, you are amazing. And we are just grateful for you in our lives to know you you are you are amazing just amazing and well, I you, it. Like a, you know we 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 just have good friends in our lives that are a good example to him now so we try to you know as much as we can surround ourselves with amazing people like you so they can learn not just from us but from the friends we have oh that's so sweet i love you guys very much neo i'm very proud of you Thank proud you. of you all the time I and mean, you know i'm always here for you if you need anything as well but i can't wait to see this whole show and can't wait for a lot of people in celebration to get to know you more so oh i i'd, I'd love to i'd love to meet them all <laughs> yeah, very good all right well you enjoy the rest of your night and uh i can't wait september is here and i'm going to be looking for this band at illuminate church oh fall's going to be great we'll, we'll see what happens that's right. That's right. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you, Kim. Bye, Love guys. you. Love you. Bye bye. Make sure that you subscribe and like so that we can continue to give you up-to-date information on all things that are going around 25 mile radius of Cinderella's castle because this is truly a magical place to live.